Hey tennis friends, once again I'm here in Rancho Mirage, California at the Rancho Las Palmas Country Club. Today is the second day of the finals for the 2010 Easter Bowl Spring Championships. Right now the girls 16 singles is on center court. Let's go inside and check out the action. Brooke Austin in the white top is serving to Kyle McPhillips in the yellow outfit. I'm here with the girls 16's champion, Kyle McPhillips. Kyle, that was a terrific match. Yeah, it was. Thank you. Yeah, your uh, uh, first set went all the way to the tie break. Did you have any anticipation of that? Um, no, I had no idea. I was up 3-0, and then she came back, won five straight games. I got down 5-3, and then somehow I pulled it back to the tiebreaker, so I was lucky just to get it to the tiebreaker. Yeah, it really seemed to go back and forth a lot. Uh, what goes through your mind when, when you're up three games and she comes and wins the next five in a row? I try not to think of that. I just try to think of what I have to do, because if I think about what the score is too much, I'll get nervous, and that's why I try to avoid. Well, you did a terrific job out there, and congratulations. Thank you so much. All right, thanks. Right now I'm here with tournament director and chairman, Brian Feinberg. Brian, how are you doing today? I'm doing good, thanks. You know, uh, it's my understanding that your family actually started this event. Well, my mother started the tournament back in 1968, and three years ago uh, I took it over. We're trying to make it bigger and better, and uh, that's our goal. Well, you've had a lot of big names. This is an important tournament on the circuit. Can you talk about that a little bit? Well, it's a national championship, and it's also one of the uh, few ITFs uh, specifically for Americans. So I think uh, with the way that we run this, it's considered uh, just about the biggest junior tournament in America. Well, I know you've had a lot of big names and everything come through, so uh, let's get back out to the courts and watch some of these matches. Sounds good. Thanks, Marcus. Appreciate it. It's the boys' 18 singles championships, and Bjorn Fratangelo in the white is serving to Nick Chappell in the red. I'm here with the boys' 18 singles winner, Bjorn Fratangelo, correct? Yeah. Now, uh, your name's Bjorn, that seems to be a tennis name. Where's that come from? Uh, I was named after Bjorn Borg, and it was my dad's idol growing up, so he figured he named me after him. Well, terrific. You know, today you won the boys' 18, but you're only 16 years old. How does that make you feel? Yeah, it makes me feel great. It makes me feel like I'm doing something right, so I'll just try to keep it up. All right, well, terrific job today. Thank you. All right, thanks a lot. Thanks a lot. Thanks. You never know who you're going to run into at an event like this, and this is one of the ball kids, Elizabeth. Elizabeth, how you doing? I'm good. Thank you. And, you know, uh, Elizabeth, we really don't know each other personally, but we've been working together for a couple years now, yeah. haven't we? I've seen you on Stadium 2 all the time at BNP. That's right. Uh, yeah. Elizabeth works as a ball kid also at the BNP Perry Ball Open. And uh, what's your favorite part about working that tournament? Um, Working with the players, like getting to be so close to my favorite players, like you see how they play on the court so close and how they act when they lose and win. It's really fun. <laughs> well, it is pretty fun. Now, you know, obviously that's a big tournament with big pros. This is a smaller tournament with a bunch of juniors. Why do you work this tournament? I don't know, because I love watching tennis and they, you never know, they may be the next big player. And also they have really good games, like they may not be the top players, but I think they have, sometimes their matches are more interesting than the pros. Yeah, it is a lot of fun to watch and I'm going to go watch some more right now. It's the boys 16 singles championship and Nolan Page in the blue is serving to Gordon Watson in the white.
Watson. I'm here with the boys' 16 singles winner, Gordon Watson. Gordon, that was quite an impressive uh, display out there Yes, today. it was. It was probably my best match of the tournament, definitely for sure. Now, did the heat uh, factor into it at all? It did a little bit in the beginning. Um, it was uh, pretty hot. The wind wasn't blowing as hard, but the wind picked up, and it kind of gave me a little refreshment. So it wasn't too bad. The singles championships have been decided, but they still have doubles championships to go. So I'm going to go back out to center court and watch some of the doubles finals. This concludes my report of the 2010 Easter Bowl. So we'll see you next time with a lot more tennis outside the lines.